side mission helping her would love to help you and your pigeons man but I'm sorry last time I took a side mission I ended up going through half the city looking at a train hey guys welcome back to the channel it's more spider-man loving the game still uh, we're getting a little bit deeper into the game you can see the game is becoming a little bit more difficult with a lot more enemies hitting and firing around you still loving the game one of the best games I've personally ever played if you ever get the chance please play it also like and subscribe keep doing what you do you're showing me a lot of love and I really appreciate it and without further ado let's do this can't forget to stop by feast need to get a look at Lee's office All right, so last time we were actually investigating a little bit of Martin Lee and we met up with like we met this military group I think they called it the Silver Linings International or something of that sort I don't even remember the names that well but they were pretty aggressive they completely Friends, wrecked us we have a very special caller breaking important news right here because where else Mayor Osborne thanks for calling in no thank you Jonah when you were publishing the bugle you were always fair to me tough sure but fair well that's my job Mr. Mayor all I have is my integrity and I won't compromise it for anyone now what's this crucial breaking news you're revealing for the first time anywhere on my show well after the brutal cowardly city hall bombing that almost claimed my life it's clear our understaffed police department needs help and i want to reassure the people of new york that i am providing it aha i said it you all heard me say we needed this are you using my idea of bringing in cops from lake placid ah no though that was a fine idea no this would be a security contractor, much like the ones our military uses to assist our troops overseas. I can't name it until the contracts are signed, but their qualifications are impeccable. Well, that sounds terrific, Mr. Mayor. Though, of course, I'll have to reserve my tough but fair final judgment until I have all the facts. I'd expect nothing less. And let me stress, this is in no way replacing our brave officers of the law. Just augmenting them in a way that cuts through the red tape and gets results and results are what we want you know i'm glad you're here so i can share my theory on how spider-man may well be working with the demons and a fascinating theory it is i'm sure but my doctors are advising me to get some rest now so if you don't mind oh of course thank you for calling in mr mayor my lines are open for you anytime jared did you hear Tom? But fair, as our new slogan, I don't care who else is using it. Don't care. All right, he's completely lost it. What's this blue thing here? I just want to see what this is all about. No, no. Side mission, helping her would love to help you and your pigeons, man, but I'm sorry. Last time I took a side mission, I ended up going through half the city looking at a train. Right, we're at feast. So let's start this mission now. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. Uh, 
I should check out Lee's office. Right, so we can talk to me. Need Let's help see with what those I learned a long time ago. You're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. <laughs> Good to know Spider-Man can't cook. Anyway, didn't he say he wanted to prepare MJ a meal? No wonder she was reluctant. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. <laughs> this office is locked. How do I get in there? Thanks. I appreciate it. I don't know. Break the door. Maybe oh. there's a vent somewhere. Huh. Never seen that room before. Why is this place so dark? I can't see anything in here. I can't see anything. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Remember the old man said, only balance can master the demon's strength. Without balance, the monster will turn on any who attempt to control it. Alright, what else do we have in here? Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. Ooh, he has a nice sword, though. Can we not pick up his sword? Alright, let's see what's inside here. Lee's parents. Looks like there's a keyhole in the frame. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? Alright, so now we need to find a key. Well, that helps. Good old Spidey sense. Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Dear May. Oh, I can't read that. Dear like May. This note is for May. Very soon you'll hear stories about me. Stories claiming I'm a terrorist and a murderer. These stories will be true. Lee really did and care about me. But the story we wrote together, the story of Feast, is also true. I want you to know that I always believed in our mission. It wasn't a front or a show. It was an honest expression of my heart. When you help someone, you truly do help everyone. Please don't let my failings shake your belief. You are strong, May. Strong enough to tell a new story at feast. One unburdened by my faults. Thank you for all you've done, Martin. I have a feeling he's not that Must terrible be a of a key person somewhere in this office. yet. Lee's journal. Yeah, let me take the key first. This fits the lock in the portrait. And then let me read this. October 2018. Wilson Fisk has been arrested. I can barely believe it. The day I've planned for, dreamed of, is finally here. sounds conflicted. But for some like reason, I hesitate. Down this path. Can I really go through with this? Things will happen so quickly if I give the word. My men will claim Fisk's arms, his explosives, his secrets. We'll use that strength to teach Norman true pain. He'll know what it is to see the things he loves 
destroyed by his own hands. By achieving that end will mean giving up so much. Everything I've built here at feast, all the good I've done here, could be wiped out if my plan succeeds. My chance is finally here, yet still I hesitate. Should I turn back? A part of me wants to, but the demon is hungry, and I don't think I'm strong enough to hold it back. What's funny is, when we took out Fisk, amazingly I'm saying this, but Jonathan did say that there'll be another person who will come in, another kingpin, or a thug in a gold chain, who's just trying to bring more rampage and war. And look, it actually is very similar to what he said. With the power void that was created when Fisk was gone, it allowed Lee to bring in his army and consume and absorb Fisk's army and become a much greater threat than before. So maybe he was onto something. Hate to say it, but the man is tough but fair and mad. But let's open this. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. Alright, so how do I do this? That seems right. Oh, I see. Let's see, can we not move this middle one? Yes. That worked. Okay. Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. Devil's breath. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. I can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Creepy. Why is that picture like in a negative? <laughs> yes, that's what you would call it. Phew. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. that one more the police had found this or may don't want to think of what could have happened I wonder what it means okay through the floor grate Is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon until he became one. He's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? No lie, this sword and that mask do still look pretty damn cool. Now, how do I get out of here? 
How convenient. A door. Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. Can get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna call it off here. Thank you again so much for watching. Drop a like, subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack plan. Where? When? Still working on that. But I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds... Destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more, but I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. This is the end of this video. I'm going to be dropping a new part really soon for it. I'm really loving the game. Thanks for all, all the love and support. Oh, hi, As always, take you? care. Harvard. Stay awesome. Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Um, uh, okay. Uh, be right there. And when we come back, we're gonna be heading over to Doc Ock's place. I, I have a feeling by. he's gonna go crazy. Because he's always been crazy in the movies. Always been crazy in the comics, so... Can't wait to see him go evil. As always, take care, stay awesome.